Yo. Normal. Normal driving here. What's this? Oh, fast travel. You can fast travel. Oh. Neat. El fast travel. Is that where I'm at? Yeah. Destination is over here. I see. Oh. Whoops. I totally know how to drive. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> oh. Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? No. Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? What? Is some sort of test. Eh, just a pet topic of mine. You mean riddles? No, Mr. V. No, ontology. I mean, shit. All right. Uniform. Listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and Sweet T-Bug helped his brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Ah. Uh -huh. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a court. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. That's a death sentence. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. V? How risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no lead here. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush-hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving with that. Second, the rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Uh, tell me about her. Why? What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, we'll be there for it all. 
Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much the you. Man, I wish I had a PS5. This would be looking pretty slick. But all I have is a PS potato. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? It's not in the shot. Or a better computer. That works too. Okay. Oh shit, a shard. Oh. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, aka Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shit's truth, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce? Royce guy. What's he like? A straight psychopath. Chrome loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. Goulash? That sounds good. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or a blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Peace. Later, dog. Homie. Homie G. Jackster. Talk to Dex. Yeah, <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I had heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. I got ran Dex over. Is talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. Nick, <laughs> you don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Yep. Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Hmm. Parker. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. But I live. In that case, I'll hit the all foods, put my nose to the ground. Stick around. Hasta luego. Hasta luego, baby. Hey, what's up? 
Can I have a burger? Are these fries free? Oh my god. Mr. V, I just want to remind you. I just want to remind you again that Eddie's have already changed hands between me and my esteemed Maelstrom partners in biz. A round sum of 10,000 to be precise. So when you're there to take it off their hands, don't let them try to shake you down as they're liable to do Maelstrom being Maelstrom. Thanks for the info. You'll need it. Best of luck. Oh, can I actually reply to people? Oh, oops. Uh, yep. Yeah. Man, this is a big guy. Don't look at me like that. Man, that's a big boy. Did you what? What? You want a piece of ass? Sorry, right, I don't understand. I won't buy anything from you. What's your name? Hi, I'm Tess. Hi, Tess. My name is V. Whoa, your legs are tripping, dude. Oh, watch it. You'll swallow a fly. Uh. But flies are protein. Oh, what up, big dude? Hey, friend. You good? No. A little hungry. Yeah? What's up in the big world? I don't know. Your name is Tess too? The Tess is over there. How'd you get over here? What the heck? What? Alright, I don't speak Spanish. Hey. Piss off, slacker! Another fucking weasel. What? It looks like you're trying to Oh my god. Is that a trash bag around you? Alright. Hey. I don't believe I've had the pleasure. Can I have some food? I'd like some food, please. Fine. Regina Jones? Thing is, these rats are human sized. Look just like tiger claws, too. Biggest one is a certain Taki Kenmochi. So do her fix her a solid and neutralize her ass, will ya? Deeds attached. Yeah, maybe. Hey. Are you fucking serious? What? Jeez. That city's infant. Night traveling around the city allows you to discover and unlock data terms. Then become fast travel with locations for you to use uh, later. Use later. <clears throat> oh, I don't know. Yeah. Wow. I feel good about this.
It's all a shit storm anyway. Yes. Fair change. Staring is rude. You know that, right? Whoa, floating. Whoa. Sorry, I'm just staring. Mom sent you. Oh, you bitch. Screw it. <laughs> I got ran over. Hey. Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a preem BD? What is a BD? What do you got? What don't Brain you dance. Got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers, no washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch, it's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? Yeah. Spoke? Damn, that sounds promising. I get it, I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, input. Welcome to Lizzie's. Shut up. Hey. My, what a sweet little face you have. Thanks. Okay. What do you want? I would like a burger, actually. I'm kind of hungry. Hey. I'm new here. Yeah. What's this? I'll just take that. If you're a dance head like us, don't miss out on Lizzie's. You'll find no better brain dance club in the city, no matter how diggy deep. So, what can a horny girl like me do for a hungry guy like you? A little vanilla and sprinkles? Or king here? Wax? Maybe electrosex? Yeah, that guy's like me. I'm pretty hungry. Power implants? I bought a burger. Here's what I want. You and your girlfriend wearing high heels, blindfolds, and big games. Mm, no problem. You buying or renting? Renting. How much? Relax. It'll go on your tab. Think I got just the thing for you, too. This one's me and Candies. You'll feel us everywhere. It's fun. So, see you on the other side, baby. Hey. How's it going? Uh, sweet, clean speed. What are you doing? What is going on? Oh, uh, sorry. It's, uh, not the right way. Hey. I have a tiger, babe. Nothing's wrong. 
really. Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just told you. Hey, what's up? Don't mind if I join you guys. Yes. What are you guys doing? Oh, that, whoa. Wow. That's nice. He did the whole exorcist thing with his head. All right, I guess I'll leave. I'm not wanting it in there. Ugh, I still feel like shit. Little hair of the dog? Yeah, yeah. Give me a Are you wrong in the head or what? Uh, yeah. I am. Thank you for noticing. Hey. Wow. She having a spaz attack? Okay. Nice. Hello? Anyone in here? Hello? The legacy of Arasaka, blah, 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 blah. So much reading. Oh, game crashed. No. <laughs> That's the second time. Maybe it's too much. This game is too much for me. It's all like, you are too much. Let's crash. Only I had a thing so I don't crash. Feels bad, man. <sighs> Thank God for auto saves. Scoozy, mom. Continue. Hey everyone, feels great to have you back. Son, did you all hear about that Arasaka aircraft carrier docked in Night City called Kujira or the Whale? Apparently, the corp figured it wasn't safe in Japanese waters, afraid some local fishermen might harpoon it for scientific research. Yes. But honestly, it's quite the power move. Wonder what Mule Tech will respond with. Maybe Myers will fly a Rust Bucket B-17 Flying Fortress over Arasaka HQ. Ooh, man, that spat is insensitive. I am so sorry, where are my manners? President Myers, I mean, of course. <laughs> Gotta respect the office. Anywho. to get back in Where is my Yes, hopefully my game don't crash again. Hey. Hey. Get you something. So curious. The name Lizzie's that the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Nice. The girls were paid right, insured, and had decent security. Good spot all in all. 
Ah, stories of the golden days. Inevitable demise and the inevitable drink over sweet memories. All what makes the tall tales easier to swallow. So, what went wrong? Tiger Claws shot up Lizzie. <gasps> Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad once. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. Gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. The big boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up, out of respect. Biz booms to this day. What can I get here? What's on the menu? We got 21st Stout. Reduces movement speed by 10, reduces weapon accuracy by 50. Te Sincha. Applies the hydration status, which increases max stamina by 10% and regen by 50% per second. For 450 seconds. Wow. I don't feel like buying anything. You could take my junk though. Bye. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know she's here. Who's asking? Your mom. Name's V. She and I have a uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh huh. So, Evelyn. Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. Just wait for this one. Eh. Hey. How's it going? Free drinks. Evelyn. Buggers. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Mmm, tequila. Free drink. Since on, only tequila I drink. <laughs> How do you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Oh, I only have three or four or whatever that is. Mind if we talk about the job? Heard you got something for me. But not here. Come with me. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. Hold up. Hold up. Hey, I leveled up. Reflexes. Increases your passive evasion. You know what? Yeah, might as well. Screw it. Movement speed after a successful takedown is increased by 30%. Increased movement speed while sneaking. Maybe. Maybe. Or throw a knife. That sounds fun. So, what can a horn do like me? Really? Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just told you. Eh? Smoke. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. The bad. I'm good at what I do. Got a solid crew on my back, too. Never once botched a job. You do realize I expect more of you than scraping street corner data terms much much more i'm the best and i know what i'm getting into dex was clear the job's high risk by the way you work together long you and dex who you write in dex's bio hate to disappoint but i just don't know much in other words you hardly know each other yep 
Yet he fingered you for this job. Oh. Huh. He fingered me good. Curious. Let's see. Got any doubts? Shit, Buzz Dex right now if you're getting cold feet. I can wait. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fixers in that respect. Used car salesmen. I'll go with my gut for now. Used car salesman. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? What? Never heard had the opportunity. Out of my price range. Classy Corp hotels? Yeah, no. Out of my price range. Hmm. Well, the decor's to die for. As you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What? So Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Hmm. Top dog like Yorinobu's bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yuri Nobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Netwatch? Wait, mutual Netwatch is mixed up in this. Netwatch provides net security for all corporations, and collects eddies in the millions for it. But in this day and age, everyone's in the game, and no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. So what's your Nobu do to walk away with? Unimportant. You focus on the biochip. What could cyberspace's watchers and protectors offer him? Intelligence on his enemies? That doesn't matter in the least. Because you'll make sure the transaction never happens and I get the chip. Okay. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device because your Nobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. One more thing. Data that's on the chip. What is it? Irrelevant. Entirely. We're talking about data Yorinobu snuck out of Arasaka. What's more, he wants to pass it on to Netwatch. Sounds pretty damn relevant to me. 
Listen, V. The relic. That's my concern. Your concern? Earning a paycheck. Just get the job done. I'll make sure your bank accounts are sated. What else you know about Yorinobu? Quite a bit, actually. He studied finance and biotech in Tokyo. <laughs> Probably didn't have a choice in the matter, come to think of it. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu vanished to chase his own dreams. Cut himself off from the corp for years. Long story short, though the black sheep returned, the bitter taste remained. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has always walked his own path and so has his own designs on the corp. Hmm. Could be another power-hungry corpo dick, like so many others. <laughs> Ever tried to imagine what life might be like for an emperor's son? You have everything, yet you are no one. Nothing. At least as long as you remain in Saburo Arasaka's shadow. I... Sympathize. It's a vulnerability I understand well. And one you plan to exploit fully. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. Yeah. Jacking off to in those boxes. Uh, yeah. No. Like anything else? It can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted. Doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Strictly Judy business, eh? She's a mox too. Besides, we go back uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So, you'll be a good boy, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Alex, believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Hey. Hey, there you are. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Don't make me barf. <clears throat> Hey, Judy. Fringe. Compiled your BD. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Whoa! She just went through me. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. That thing stuck on my screen. Street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? What do you mean by raw? How's this differ from the ready mates? Huh. Ready maids, provided they're well made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass market shit, so it's pre-crafted, hard-coded, fenced in, and manageable. A raw uh -huh. one? Well, it's more like a virtue enviro. Get to move around, look at things in detail. 
Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Yay. You like my boxer short? I mean, my uh, uh, basketball shorts? Words. Dude, why is that thing on my screen still? You create your sensory profile first. A what? A what profile now? A model of your perceptions and emotional responses. Need to adjust that so the raw BD won't overwhelm you. If I don't, best case scenario, you'll get nauseous as soon as you're in. Probably barf like you would in a shoddy virtue viral. Mm hmm. And worst case? Your synapses sizzle like locusts in a deep fryer. We're not about to let that happen. Nuh -uh. Okay. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingle. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. It's an eye exam. Get a lot of requests like this? All the time. But it's usually stuff the girls scroll at the club. I take that and do some routine porn tuning. Crank up the orgasms? More like cut out all the other shit. Fucking's business as usual for these guys. Their minds wander. To the grocery list, spouses' birthdays, late bills, whatever. But even then, you can Lizzie Jizzies? Mold the emotions into something unique, unforgettable. So, I can't complain. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we... Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Size won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. What did you choose? What did you choose? Corner store hold up in Haywood. Real amateurs. Don't even know where I got it. Suits our needs perfectly though. You ready? Yeah, let's do it. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearing. Then we'll jump into editing. Be diving in and three, two, one. Do 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 do. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Why is my screen fucked? Immersion. Just breathe slowly, calmly. You're okay. 
It's all right. Intense shock. I can still feel it. I remember. Fuck that last second. Could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up. Let's switch over to editing mode. Well, that thing's can't save right now. Crap. I'll do the save. That thing's annoying. Loading. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Full scene of yours. Full cam control and analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So analysis mode, you control playback. You can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Lock. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Let's save it. Oh. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Should Bring I it back I... to the top. All good with me. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing unlock. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash. Yeah. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. What? Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And re remember. Everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Indicates current and select a layer, visual layer, thermal layer, sound layer. Old sections on the track to get a scanning clue. Clue will be highlighted for the duration of the sequence if the editor is set to the correct layer. Clues may overlap each other. The spot where they overlap on the recording track was especially bright. After being successful scan, the clues disappear from the track. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything. Every little detail. Even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay. Fuck! On you go. Ah, little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sounds, explore it a bit. Can't and save. Go, get bored. go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? Okay. We have a deal today on play. Cody and yeah, Serpent. Everybody! Up to the ground! Wanna see you kissing the flooring? Mud now, bro! Fucking rub your swing on! Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller's fiberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. 
Hello, nice. Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. What? All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. <laughs> now! Shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. What? Oh. Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Sounds good. Uh... Right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when. Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T Bug to link in. Whoa, 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 who? Runner for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Evelyn, I won't get a damn thing out of this without T-Bug. Judy, please. Ev, he wants to bring a runner in? What part of that don't you understand? How do I know she'll only purge in this footage, observe, not fuck with anything? Me. I'm your guarantee. Yeah, right. Help me. This one last time. I promise everything will work out. Just like we planned. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V. What's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Kanpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Kanpeki? Oh. Uh, as much. Someone there with you? Unimportant, T-Bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? I'm Milisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick temp ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire up, Judy. Blah, 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 blah. My game's glitched with this med pack thing on the right. It's so annoying. Max Doc Mark One. You look like a cut of 
fuck will meet, are you? Evelyn, she... I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. What? What am I looking for? Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Alarm firmware's fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. What? Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling, servers, gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's involved. attired. Visual as old graybeard. Who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble i should not even be listening to such things you will listen to this saburo is an adult despot utterly removed from reality stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists of a world that may never have existed we have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must not provide them. In Heard that? Relic docs gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Some... <laughs> What? We shall see soon enough. Uh, I mean, see, see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken up the I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please. I'm confused. We have not seen eye to eye for the past two years. Now, read the documentation carefully. Carefully. 
I'm confused. You wish to make demands of me? Only one. Focus on me. Oh, got any candy left? Man. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta go <coughs> and check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Not the last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. Manual details a special temp control container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip. Damn it. Oh, Donna Geese. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I do need to finish all as fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. He's taken a particular interest. Hmm. This project, he can certainly exp Right. Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Ah. Your has got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Get out of the editor. Missed a bunch of stuff. Lol. Lol. Get everything you need? Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got. Well, on that note, I gotta do some things. Be back in a few. Alright, later.